Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Barbell and welcome back to some more Outlast action. Before I get this episode underway, I just wanted to wish you all a very happy Halloween. I hope you guys have a good time and come home safe. Don't do anything too stupid, but be sure to have some fun because Halloween, in my opinion, is the best holiday of them all. And I will celebrate by torturing myself uh, by playing through this game some more. And I'll probably play something else just for Halloween night because why not? If there's any night to get pissed scared, it is Halloween. So, yeah, I hate to spam your guys' uh, sub box with this game. I know uh, at the time of this recording, I have part 15 uploading, and this is part 16. But uh, I really think I'm towards the end of the game here, so I kind of just want to get it out of the way. And after Outlast, I will be starting Elder Scrolls IV Oblivion. Uh, so I can go through here. What's in here, though? Library. And my camera. Why did I hear the, the music like somebody's chasing me? Or the music like somebody's walking around? You know the music that goes dun? Yeah, whatever. Okay. Retrieve the key from the recreation hall. God, man. All this shit I have to go through just to catch up to damn Father Martin. <laughs> like, like I mentioned in the last episode, can you just stop for five damn seconds so I can catch up? This would be a whole lot easier. Alright, that's a dead end. The library's through that way. Can I go down here? Can I open this? Can I go back through here? This is... No, I can't. Well, this is the main lobby from the beginning of the game. And I remember I uh, left behind a document. There was a document in uh, on that desk over there. And when I watched the recording back, I noticed I missed it. But I guess I can't go back and get it now. Who's that? Is that Father Martin? Is that a younger Father Martin? I doubt it. Okay. So I could... Oh, here we go. Floor 2, Recreation Hall, is this way. So what was in the library? Why did it... Ugh, nasty blood squishy sound effect. <laughs> Why did it sound like there was somebody in here? My dude is freaking out and it's making me freak out. So, oh, document. Sorry for getting all quiet. I mean, my guy's like breathing all hard and it makes me think there's someone in here with me. Uh, ooh, translated from German. If you guys would like to read this, go ahead and pause. I see there's a second page, so I will flip it right now. Signature ineligible, okay. I've noticed that about signatures. A lot of people just kind of scribble a little whatever. Really? That scared me. I thought I heard somebody like boning or something. I'm getting out of here, man. Shut that. I probably missed something in there, but the music was just freaking me out. Like, holy shit. Okay. And isn't this the squeeze through area where uh, Pudge got me? Yeah, there's the broken window. Alright, enough stalling, I guess. It's time to try and locate the recreation hall. And that crazy dude said the key was behind the light in the theater or something like that. 
or watch the, I don't know, watch the movie. Okay, can I open this? No. That's a cool looking door, but can't open it. I don't know if I want to keep this camcorder up now. Okay, I do now. Cool. Billiards, nice. Dead guy. I guess he tried to hustle someone in a game of pool and they didn't like that, so uh, <laughs> they took care of him. Is there anything up here? Nice big flat screen TV. Uh, okay, that is the clear and obvious way to go, but uh, let's see if I can go back over here. Another dead guy. Um, let's see. Oh, shut that. Uh. Onward to wherever this is, I guess. Oh, battery. Get that. Dead guy. Okay, so I can go up here, I guess. Let's see what's over here. Exit, yeah, right, I'll believe that when I actually go through the door and it's an actual exit. Until then, I don't believe it. <coughs> I can't wait for whenever I get out of here. Right, making sure there's no one up there. Shimmy. Gotta shimmy! Alright, what's gonna happen? Something bad is gonna happen. Right? Wall Rider? Someone's gonna pop up. No? Okay. Are those lockers? Yes. They might come in handy. Oh, you're gonna get down or? Oh, there we go. Oh! Ow. Make sure no one's waiting on the other side, god damn it. Hello? Whoa, you are weird. He was playing the piano, that sounded really nice. And now he's gone. Uh, ooh, can I hide under here? Nope, too fat. Too fat. Uh, I'm gonna change my battery. <laughs> okay, what's going down in here? Whoa! This broken lens is making all kinds of weird... Making things look like there's something they're not. It's scaring the hell out of me. Okay. Guess I'll go this way. Oh, what's that? What is that? Dead guy? Wheelchair guy? Wait, is that the theater room? That is the theater room. He said it was behind the light, so it's in here somewhere. Okay, so the piano was in the theater room for some reason. Ah! Uh, exit interview recorded December 27th, 1985 in Los Alamos, New Mexico. Clearance Sierra Alpha. Subject, Dr. Rudolph Wernicke, 148. I'm here. Uh, there was no alteration to the footage at all? No trickery? None. He enjoyed
June of 1943, you recorded three instances of spontaneous bleeding. Uh, I don't know if I should sit here and watch this, or... test subjects began to develop brain tumors? Yes. The autopsies revealed that the tumors were pure lead. Wow, that Children? doesn't sound very fun. Pure lead tumors. Can you explain why the results... Ah, man! In the United States? That is Here's such a troll tactic. God damn it. My Exit? Yeah, I didn't think so. So I think this is Dr. Vernicki talking? Vernicki? Something like that. Is that it? Is that the end of the movie? Okay. Well, what a great film. Five stars, two thumbs up, I guess. Shut that. Great lockers. Wow, the classic wheelchair on its side with the wheel still spinning gag. Gotta love that. <laughs> Really reminds me of Silent Hill. All right, what the fuck's going on in here? Well, lockers out the ass to hide in. Nope. What if I can open that? Only way. There's some dude in there. Okay. Did he say you have to find Vernicky? He's not dead? Is he the wall rider? Oh gee, best save me now. Alright, let's go ahead and reload this. Okay. Why does this all seem too easy? Too easy, man. Oh, document. And joinal action! Wow, very short. Flesh eating bacteria? Wash those hands regularly. Winking smiley face. Okay. Really? I fucking quit. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'd quit too if that's how my boss responded to a uh, flesh eating bacteria outbreak. I guess. Okay. Well, that was kind of short. Oh, God, that is blinding. Do not turn on night vision in here. Is that it? Is there really nothing else? Doesn't look like I can open that. Um, okay. Guess up the stairs. Great. I'm assuming the projector's up here. Right. And I have to crawl down here. All right. Really? I'm being all quiet because I'm just waiting. Ooh, battery. You know, I'm just waiting for that moment where there's somebody here. Something happens. <laughs> Fuck! Get in the goddamn locker! <laughs> Fuck you! Fuck you, game! It's like it knew I said that. Oh. Oh, there's a single tear rolling down my cheek for some reason. <laughs> uh.
Oh my god. Alright, against my better judgment, let's open this goddamn door. Oh no, I can't open the door. Can I? Is there another way in there? No, I can't open the door. Uh, what the hell? Oh, there's that asshole. Hey, okay. oh, shimmy. Oh, God, that scared me so much, or so badly. Oh my God. This is making me nervous too. What do I do now? Jump? Really? Oh boy. Alright, let's do it. Count of three. One, two, three. Huh! Hooray! Shut that. Shut that. Oh, now the door's open? Really? Shut that. Uh, key? What the hell? This, look this guy looks like he just committed suicide. Um, look for anything else interesting. Nope, nothing. I'm gonna reload my battery in preparation for something happening. I'm fully enclosed in here, so at least there's that. Feels somewhat safe. Uh, go ahead and pick up the key. <sighs> Find Father Martin on the third floor. So I just need to go back. Back to where you came! Hey. Um... Do I shim- no, I can't shimmy. So I have to open this. Is there somebody waiting out there for me? Fuck. Okay. Ah. I'm assuming all these lockers are going to come in handy for something, right? That's not Pudge, is it? Oh, I swear to fucking Christ, it better not be Pudge. He was bang- someone's banging open a door somewhere, and it was shaking my screen. Oh boy. Whoa, jeez! <laughs> ah, these tubas again. Are they all carrying around the tubas? Just blaring them wherever they go? Oh, I hear footsteps. Whose footsteps are those? Wait, did, was there a door there I could have shut? God damn it, I should have shut that door. Oh well. Okay. Shut it. Shut it. Thank you. That was a naked dude. Oh. Oh, god damn it. God damn it. That was a naked dude. The nakeds are here, guys. They're back. I wish there'd be like an epic showdown of Pudge versus the nakeds. Do you know how badass that would be? <laughs> uh, just let them fight to the death and leave me the hell alone. Alright. Let's go. I guess. Shut that, please. Where the fuck am I going, guys? Oh, 
Oh, Jesus. What do you want? You're just gonna stand there, right? Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm leaving, guys. I'm... Yeah, I'm going this way. You stay in there. Just leave me the hell alone. Run. Fucking run. What the hell? Hey! Come on, man. Father Martin, you're making this way harder than it needs to be. Like, for real, for real, for real. Wait a minute. Elevator? Wait, can I open this? No. Freedom? Oh, there's the spooky ghost noises again. Find Father Martin on the third floor. Didn't I just check all the doors? And I couldn't open them? That's locked. That's locked. Oh, is this one? Can I open this one? Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's locked as well. Alright then. Oh boy, another kitchen. Brings back those lovely Traeger memories. And a slightly ajar door. Sweet. Radio. There's all kinds of- there's radios everywhere. Like these box radios and there's handheld walkie-talkies everywhere too. Oh no. no. That doesn't look like a naked dude. At least not completely. I believe that those guys don't wear pants for some reason, but at least they're not completely naked. Right, let's go ahead and open this. Fuck. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, that organ music is really cool. What's that? Oh! He's just standing there, having a good old time. Can I go in there? Nope. That looks like the way to go. But, let's see if there's anything else over here first. Uh, I don't see anything. Oh. The fuck? Wait, then what's that... the vent for? Now let's get to the end here. Reload. Reload! Okay. I don't want to venture too far. Another billiards room. For a mental asylum, they sure have a lot of billiards, huh? Oh, jeez. No pants! God, the lack of pants in this place. Can I pick up the pool stick? I'd like to- Oh god, there's another dude. Praying there. Hello? You friendly? Oh, notes. The static again. A patient knelt in prayer. Maybe he bought Father Martin's line of bullshit. Maybe he hears what I hear, but more clearly. Maybe it's his way of out of this place. The priest called it the Gospel of Sand. I don't recall that. But I'll take your word for it, buddy. Um, okay, now I'm curious. I'm curious about that, uh vent back there. You know what? I'm gonna go back there and see if I can go up in that vent. See how that's like just a clear... Hey, go this way because there's a bunch of light there. Uh, this is wonky. What is the point of this? Uh, 
I don't get it. What what is what is the point of this? Am I to hide from something up here later? Well, let's just lay on the stove. Okay, I don't get what the point of that was. I guess I'll keep it in mind for later. Or something. What the hell? Alright. This episode has been going on for a little while, but I guess it's a Halloween special, so why not? More spooks for the night of ultimate spooky. Oh, jeez. Please don't flip your shit. Just leave me alone. Okay, he's knelt in prayer. He's praying. He's praying. He's doing his prayer thing. Wait. Okay, there's that. Is there anybody praying in these stalls? To clo close the toilet seat? That would have been pretty interesting. Uh -uh. Okay. God, there's so many. Oh. Is this the same dude? No. Do you guys have any batteries I could steal? Are those pants? For God's sake, man, put them on. <laughs> Alright, that's kind of weird. This is also weird. Are those more pants? This has to be so This ha There has to be a point to that. This just can't be a coincidence anymore. Seriously, open. Fuck. Gee, this doesn't look like a way to go or anything. Alright, I'll explore the rest first. Guys, I would like some batteries. Ah, uh, slightly ajar door, why? Ooh, document. Give me that. Join all! Uh, I'm gonna read this real quick. Okay, are they waiting for the wall rider? What the f Okay, so it looks like there's nothing down that way. Aha! All my adventure has not be for nothing, for I located Battery of Victory. Alright, let's open this shit up. God damn it. Alright, that was less frightening than I expected. Good. I'm always okay with that when that happens. Shut that. Hey, hope you don't mind I sh slammed that door shut in your ear. Wait a minute, do I have to walk out there? You know what, I think we're gonna go ahead and end the episode here. I think it's been going on for about 30 minutes and I don't know what's gonna happen when I go out this window. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this Halloween special extra long Outlast episode. And uh, yeah, guys, have a happy Halloween. Be safe, but have a good time. And I'll see you all in the next in the next episode. Take care, everybody. Bye.